Hello, Anatomy and Physiology. I am here with you guys today to um, show you the blood type simulation lab. Hopefully you already have copied this down into your notebook. Please do so if you haven't already and go ahead and pause um, the video. This, if you can't read it through the video, is posted just up above as an image within this Google form where you should be watching this video. I'm going to show you sort of the lab setup and you can do the pre-lab and then we will video the results here. All right, so we are here with the lab setup. Um, if you want to do this at home, I have another video that shows kind of an at home setup using some um, items that you probably have at home. I'm assuming you don't have well plates at home and probably not pipettes, um, but this gives you sort of a clear image of everything. So what I have here are um, labeled okay, um, different blood types, so quote unquote, um, using food coloring. So the color red is representing blood type A, which I have in my first row here. And then blood type B is represented by blue. AB is a mixture of the red and the blue, so it's a purple, although on the screen it looks a little bit of a black. And then you can hardly tell that there's liquid in here, but there is, um, in this bottom row, there is just clear water for representing O. And then I'm not using those bottom two rows for today. Um, so you are to decide as you watch the results video as if the blood is safe to transfuse or not safe. And what we are looking for is a color change. 